10 standard social science revised textbook videos chapter 29 india natural disasters first main answer the following after discussing them in groups what are natural disaster naturally occurring destructive incidents resulting in loss of human life and property are called natural disasters What are the effects of cyclones? Cyclones are very destructive. Sometimes the life of the people of cyclone hit areas gets totally changed. They cause large scale death. Ocean tides inundate the inland water bodies and make them salty. Crops get totally destroyed. transport links electricity supply and the daily life of the people get affected badly cyclone hit areas suffer from infectious diseases leading to huge casualties what are floods when there is heavy rainfall and excessive melting of ice the volume of water increases in the river leading to it overflow this is called floods what is landslide land mass sliding down the slopes from mountains or hills are called landslide what is earthquakes vibration or movement of the upper layers of the earth due to the pressure created inside called earthquake What are the causes of floods describe flood prone areas the uncertainty of monsoon rainfall accumulation of silt in the rivers led to overflowing of water on either side of the river breach of dams or retention walls leads to sudden release of large quantity of water rivers changing their course heavy rainfall during cyclones earthquakes in the sea man made causes like deforestation improperly built dams weak retention walls illegal encroachment of land are also important causes flood prone regions the ganges and its tributaries yamuna gandak kosi gagra rivers cause floods in uttar pradesh and bihar damodar suvarnareka rivers cause floods in chatisgarh and west bengal states brahmaputra and its tributaries dibang dihang subansiri and lohit rivers cause floods in assam cloud burst often causes abrupt floods in the himalayas narmada tapti sabarmati and mahi rivers cause floods for some days in a year in the state of gujarat krishna tungabhadra ghataprabha malaprabha doni bannihalla etc cause floods during rainy season in karnataka what is coastal erosion mention its management the erosion of land by the waves in the coastal areas is called coastal erosion 
management prohibiting sand mining in coastal areas constructing retention walls along the length of coast wherever waves are strong stocking of large rocky boulders along the coast to reduce the impact the most effective method of preventing coastal erosion is by growing mangrove forest along the coast write about the effects of earthquake and precautions to be taken the effects of earthquakes the loss of life and destruction of property obstruction to transport spread of infectious diseases increased tidal activity tsunamis change in reverse direction precautions measures to be taken restricting construction of multi storied building in earthquake prone areas using very light material for construction of houses in these areas constructing houses to ensure stability providing basic amenities to the quake affected areas disconnecting power supply in the event of an earthquake